All right, so what is going on everyone? Swan here and today we're back with some more Battle Royale and I don't know how I'm doing it, but we're at 11 wins. We're 11 and one and this is just crazy to me. I don't know how I'm here. Last game, I scored nine runs in one inning. It was the second inning. It was the bottom of the second and I hit a grand slam, I think. I hit, I don't know, a bunch of other stuff, like another home run. And actually, maybe I only had one home run. I don't know, it was just hit after hit after hit. And it was absolutely crazy. And I don't know what I'm doing right now, but it's going, it's going well, it's going well. So let's go, let's try and get this $150,000, not dollar, stub worth card, Roy Oswalt. So, Let's see if we can do it. Not 12 and 0, but it, it it'll it'll have to do. So, anyways, let's jump right into a game and let's see if we can win. All right. Well, we finally found an opponent. It took forever. I was lost on my phone. And I looked up and I found someone. Uh, but anyways, Jake Lamb, JD Martinez, Eric Carlos, Tyler Naquin, which is a bronze card. Troy Tulowitzki, rookie card. Bronze. Travis Jankowski, barely a bronze, only 70 overall. Eduardo Nunez. And Robinson, whatever you want to call it, I'm not going to try it again. Uh, and it looks like he's got a pretty solid squad, actually. He's got Gregory Polanco. He's got Ken Griffey Jr., 99 overall. Um, 91 Francisco Lindor, Gold, Miguel Cabrera, just regular live series, I believe. Uh, Silver jo Joey Gallo. Gary Sanchez live series, live series Carlos Beltran, a lot of live series cards that you don't really see all that many of. You really don't see many regular Cabrera, regular uh, Sanchez, regular, uh, who's the last one, Beltran. But anyways, without further ado, let's get into this game. I, oh my gosh, this is actually crazy. Like, I never... I, I don't, these moments always feel so weird. Koji Uhara still with the zero ERA. We're gonna have to use him real quick in this game and hopefully it goes well. But anyways, let's see what we can do with Jake Lamb. And first pitch of the game is a ball. Love to see it. Let's go. Looks like we're playing in Wrigley. And there we go. He gets his first strike. Nice pitch. That was a solid pitch. I, I didn't really like it. I, it was a little bit too into the zone, it's, which is kind of weird to say, but like if I would have gone all the way up, probably would have just grounded it. So anyways, come on. You know, now he's going to give me a strike. I bet it's a little pattern. Let's see if he gives me a strike. And he does, and he left it right down the middle, and I missed it. Oh, that is not a pitch I'm going to get back. That is, that is very unfortunate. And why did I swing? I swung so late. I swung so late on that. Oh man. Okay, JD JD Martinez. Let's see what he gives me here. I'm surprised he isn't switching to his bullpen yet. A little bit weird, but let's see what we can do. And JD gets a little base hit. That's what I like to see. And it looks like I'm just gonna get a little single out of that. I'll take it. A little sinking liner. Um, so now we got Eric Karos up. And let's see if he gives me something to hit now this time. And it looks like the wind is blowing out to left field. I don't know about blowing out. It looks like it's just going straight sideways. So uh, he gets a little fastball in there. It was a nice pitch. I didn't really like that one either. Um, but he's got a lot of power versus righties. So I don't know what to expect. That was a nice pitch to hit. I don't know why I didn't hit that. And Karos, no way! Just right to him. I can never get... Why don't they ever have it pull it down the line? Like, I, I'm not swinging every time to the point where it just goes to the third baseman. I guarantee some of these pitches should definitely be out of the strike zone. Or, I'm, what am I saying? Out of the strike zone. Should be getting down the line. But anyways, we're going to toss a sinker up there. Looks like we got uh, Gregory Polanco up, which is... Um, not not the most normal leadoff player and he drills it down the line which looks like it's actually gonna be a triple that is so stupid I actually can't believe that that just happened there's no way that that should be a triple from Gregory Polanco I don't know oh Jesus okay um should I walk the bases loaded I'm actually considering that um because I really don't want to let up a run Let's just put in Uehara and see what happens. I think we're gonna 
Eh, we'll just, we'll just, we'll just go like this. We'll just, no way. No way my second baseman can't get that. And no one's going to get it. Oh my gosh. I can't believe this game. I can't believe that. That was an absolute bloop that should not have even been a bloop. Like, that doesn't make any sense to me. Um, I just don't even understand. Last game came back, like, really kind of ridiculously. But uh, this game, hopefully I can. But seriously, like, that is just stupid. And he steals a base? It didn't even, like, notify me, I swear. I wasn't even, like, ready for it. But, uh, anyways, somehow Griffey gets a hit right there, and somehow that's not a strike. Oh my gosh, how is that not a strike? Uh, nice pitch. Nice pitch, Yohara. Okay. Um, I just don't understand this game sometimes. Nice cutter. There we go. Let's see if we can get him with this curve. This is just an absolutely filthy curve. Perfect pitch, dude. Why is he so good? Why is he so good? Okay, we got Joey Gallo up, and we're just going to toss that... He hasn't hit this like once yet, and he's like check swung or swung every time now. Um, but anyways, let's go. Shoot, please don't hit it out. Oh, no way you didn't get that. Dude, you're Tulowitzki. You're one of the greatest fielders of all time. How do you not grab that ball? I don't understand this game. Like seriously, that, that, that would have stopped a run and I just left that ball up, but somehow gets it and there's out number three but he scores two runs because my fielders are absolute idiots first of all they should have caught that catch Tulowitzki should have had that I know it was a diving play but seriously like give me a break oh my gosh my scoring hasn't been as as good as I would hope it would be in this whole run other than last game I scored nine runs in that inning but it's just like it comes to the point where I get those little random runs of just hit after hit after hit but I have certain games where I just can't get a hit. So, um, let's see what happens. We got Naquin up, and he's still has this uh, common pitcher in. So, I don't know if he's going to keep that. It's a little bit strange. And no way. I was so much earlier on that. I was so much earlier on that to the point where it should not have gone to the left side at all. If anything, pull it to the right uh, side of the infield and get to the second baseman because that is just stupid. But uh, anyways, Tulowitzki goes out of play. Oh my gosh. Dude, this game just doesn't make any sense to me sometimes. It really doesn't. And Tulowitzki just hit a bomb. Hit the pole. Oh my god. Please give me a comeback. Please give me a comeback. Let's go, Jana Kaskey. Okay, should we, I think I'm going to toss in, I think I'm actually going to toss in someone. We're going to put in Renfro and then probably, yeah, okay. Let's just see, let's just see, if I can hit another home run right here, that would be huge. And I think we should warm up, uh, let's go Kelvin Herrera. But we got Uhara still on the mound and I don't think he's going to let up a run. And Renfro just, I told you, just like that. Every time it's right to the shortstop, or to the third baseman. You, it, you can't catch a break in this game. They have to update the stuff to where it doesn't just go every time to the person. And how does that... Okay, I'm going to stop complaining. I need to get in a better mood. I'm just yelling at my TV at no one. But anyways, here we go. We got Splitter. So nasty. Come on, Yuhara. We need, I need you. I really need you right here. I just, I can't let up a run, and I need to be hitting on my A game next inning. Okay, let's see if we can get him with the splitter. I should have probably thrown a curveball because that thing is nasty, but that was also a good pitch. I'm surprised he laid off that. But this curveball, dude, how do you lay off this? Especially when it's like that. Oh, that was in the dirt. They made him run for that. That is just ridiculous. Oh my gosh, Joe Panic. Okay. Um, let's go Splitter. I think he's going to be early on it if he swings. And he is, just a little bit. But anyways, that's going to be a nice, easy ground out. And now we got Pitcher? We do. We got Tony Sip up. And... I might actually check out his bullpen real quick. I need to see who he has running back there. 
because um, I seem to know what I'm dealing with. Okay, he's probably going to put in column A. He's got Will Smith, and that's about it. Everyone else is a low bronze. So it's Wall, Will, Wall Smith, Will Smith, Wall Street? Will, Will Smith and that other dude, um, Alex Colome. So I'll take it. Um, terrible pitch. Awful. And who's up right now, first of all? Clint Robinson. Okay. I'm not too worried about him. Let's go. A little curveball. A little curveball. Nice. There we go. I knew he wasn't going to get a hit on that. Um, I will take that and run with it, hopefully. Just, he's going to put in Colome right away because I think my catcher's up. Yeah, he is. Oh, jeez. No, he's going to put in Bud Norris. Okay. Uh, probably not a bad call because now if he really needs Colome, he can just put him in after. Um, because he, uh, he knows he's going to have to switch for the next uh, person up since I'm going to be uh, pinch hitting for Uehara. So, anyways, I am not going to swing. I'm going to be extra patient. That was a nice pitch that I could have just right up the middle. Probably would have hit his knee and he would have fielded it for an out. But, uh, there we go. No way! How does that not drop? The wind is going to left field. How does that not drop? Now we're going to put in Shevler and he's going to take out... Um, his pitcher and he's not is he not okay we got Shebler up and okay he throws at 94 but I should not have been that late on it how does that happen come on okay cutter inside I didn't I haven't even looked at his pitchers he got a slider cutter change up four seam two seam okay mostly fast pitches so I need to be ready on it. Oh, don't give me that. Oh, don't give me that. That is not a strike. Give me a hit. No way. Dude, how does he hit it so softly? That was the softest hit I've ever seen. That is weak. And now he's going to put in Will Smith. And now I have to put in Sandberg. And now I'm screwed. Absolutely screwed. All I need is JD Martinez to get up though. I am so frustrated with this. Okay, give me something to hit. Okay, wasn't looking for that. And another freaking just. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, I, sorry, letting my frustrations get the best of me, but it's just games like that. It's just stupid. He gets three hits, two runs, not even a home run, just complete BS hits. Like, I, I can't even explain how frustrating that is as someone who's trying to get, uh, I mean, like, yeah, the reason why I'm getting so mad for the most part is because, like, I'm trying to make a solid video where I get all these rewards and everything, but when this happens and it costs you a win in a crucial situation. It just gets so frustrating. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry that I'm getting mad in some of these videos. But anyways, you know, thank you guys so much for watching. Grab a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe here if you are new. We're gonna try and do better next time. But anyways, that's gonna be it for me today. So uh, as always, I hope you're all having a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Peace out everyone.